progress. I mean, there's always room for improvement, but overall, doing very well. Afri African music is doing well. Not, not just uh, hip life, uh, Afrobeats is like wor worldwide now. I mean, when we started, um, my father spoke up about this day, and I lived long enough to see. You know, today, you have the Fuse ODGs all the way to Burner Boy. I mean, you have young Africans who are filling up the uh, Royal Albert Hall in the UK. I live to see that. And I was on the forefront of the whole revolution, which is the hip life story. That's the same story that inspired young Africans all over the world. So what we need to do is not downplay, just like Dr. Aliman's story, just like Osajifu's story, same thing. I must see being in that, but yeah, you be. I, I'm too humble to even answer. That. I've just been a like very simple. Humility has always been my shield. I was raised so. Um, I know when I pass, there's gonna be a lot of talk. <laughs> yeah, just like everybody. Ooh, I know my God. But uh, as for my accolades, uh, I think I have enough for my wife, and and you know those who know know. No, I'm, I'm, I'm content. I'm, I've never been an award guy. I didn't come from that school. So, you know, I'm alive, healthy. <laughs>